Hi everyone, welcome to this episode of the Hobbity Short News. So this new, I a bit excited. One that received the lineup they're gonna coming out in the market because some of the item here I really can't wait to arrive in the market. It's really nice. What is that about? I will share with you later. Alright, as I promised you, I'm going to give you something very excited. For me, myself, I really like it so much. Here we go. The first one. Oh my gosh. This is... Okay, oh, I don't know what to say. I really like it. The moment I received the... I cannot control myself, okay? Okay, come back to the, come back to the topic. So the first item I'm going to share with you today is called uh, The For Real Godzilla from the Godzilla vs. Kong movie, 2021. As you can see for the picture, it's so nice and cute. I'm a great Godzilla fan actually. So, really, really nice. And the Japan retail price for this particular item is 8,000 yen, which is, of course, tax is not included. And the Jane code for this particular item, and what is a Jane code? Jane code basically is a unique code for every figure and every item is selling in the market. So the moment you key in a Jane code into the any search engine, you will see more detail and more description and as your picture as well for this particular item. So what is the Jane code for this item is 45321490201. And the maker of making it is called a Plax. And the product line is called a Deep For Real. And the series title is a Godzilla vs. Kong. And the character, who else? The Godzilla. They're gonna coming out in the month of February 2022. And it's start with an approximate height of 13 cm and with a length of 16 cm. Okay, this is including this is including the tail as you can see from the picture itself. And the major material making it is a PVC. The second item, okay. In it will be in my collection list as well. We have Artifacts Artist Series Star Wars, A New Hope, Dark Vader, The Ultimate Evil, PVC pre-painted, easy assemble kit. This is going to be heavy for me because the Japan retail price is a bit high. But this expected, uh, this expected for the artifact series. So this is uh, selling for twenty eight thousand yen, which the tax is not included. Obviously, this is the Japan retail price. And the Jane code for this particular item is four nine three four zero five four zero two one three seven six. And the maker we're making it is a Koto Fukia with a series line of product line, sorry, of artifacts. And the series title will be the Star Wars character, the Wader. So this is stand with an approximate height of 400 millimeter, with a scale of 17 scale, including the base. And they're gonna coming out in the month of March 2022. And the major material of making it is a PVC. And this one, what is happening over here is this particular item they come with the art card featuring the new illustration by the Sinichi Hiromoto. Okay, as you can see from the picture, that is the, how the art card would look like. Next item, item number three for today is the Rising of the Shield Hero Raftaria Chao version 1.7 figure. And they come with a Japan retail price. In terms of scale figure, I would say this is kind of cheap because it's only cost for 13,800 yen only. And the Jane code for this particular item is 4571-498-445612. And the brand of making it is a Bifu. And the series title is a Rising of the Shield Hero. And the character name is called Raptaria. And they're gonna coming out in the month of December 2021. And the stamp with approximate height of 182 millimeter. This is according to the scale of 17. 
and the major metal making it is a PVC and as well as ABS. Next item, item number four for today is from the Raiden V Director Card FT00004A Azuma 1100 Plastic Model Kit. They come with a Japan retail price of 4,500 yen only, which the tax is not included, obviously. And the Jane code for this particular item is 4582-3623-83640. And the maker of making it is called a Plum, and with a series title of Raiden V Director Card. And the character of this is FT00004A, Azuma. And they're gonna coming out in the month of November 2021. And they come with an approximate length, once you build up the entire model kit, will be the length of 180 millimeter. This is according to the scale of one to 100. Coming up together with the same series as well. As well and we have the next one will be Raiden V Director Card FT00004A Azuma 2P Color Version And this uh, this is considered a 1100 plastic model kit And they come with a Japan retail price of 4,500 yuan which the tax is not included again This is the same price with one we had before The only difference is the color scheme So the Jane code for this item is 4582-3623 84074 and the maker of making it is called a plum with the series title of Raiden V Director Card and the character of this is the same like what we had before just now which is the FT00004A Azuma but this is considered as a 2P color and the release date for this is November 2021 which is the same with the previous red color version and they come with a length of the 180mm according to a scale of 1 to 100. Next one and will be the last one for today's sharing will be the Duck Stalker Bishoju Duck Stalker Duck Stalker Morrigan 1.7 figure. And this is the scale figure we selling with a Japan retail price of 13,000 yen. And this is not included the tax obviously. And the gen code for this particular item is 4934-0540-28795 And the maker of making it is a Koto Pukia And the series title is a Dark Stalker or we call it Vampire And the character is a Morrigan Aslan And they're coming out in the month of March 2022 And the figure size including the base is that with a height of 228mm this is according to the scale of 1-7. Alright, and that will end up our sharing for today. Thank you very much for your subscribe, for those who do so. For those who haven't subscribed to our channel, please help us to click on the subscribe button and click on the notification, notification bell so that we notify when a new update and new video is released. Thank you very much one more time. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay with us. I'm Sean from the Hobility. Bye-bye.